Good morning, guys. All right, we are still talking about plural nouns today in our grammar lesson. So we are going to talk about a different kind of plural noun today, though it's called an irregular plural noun. So we know what a noun is. We know it's a person, a place, a thing, or maybe even an idea. We know what plural means. It means more than one when you have lots of things. But what does irregular mean? Because remember, we're talking about irregular plural nouns. We know what plural, we know what nouns are, but what does irregular mean, an irregular plural noun? Well, irregular means not, not regular, not normal. And they're called irregular, they're not normal, because they don't follow the normal rules. We talked about those three rules for plural nouns, you know, just stick an S on it. Oh, but if it has an X, an S, a CH, or an SH, you put an ES. And sometimes if it has a Y, you're going to put an IES if it has a consonant in front of the Y. So those were the rules we talked about. But these nouns that we're going to look at don't follow those rules. There's, they are irregular. They're rule breakers. They don't follow the rules. So let's look at some of these rule breakers. The first one is the word foot. Now, we know foot, we know what that is, but what if you have more than one foot? Is it called foots? Sorry. Is it called foots? I have two foots? No, it's not called foots. That's not even a real word. Foot changes to, yeah. So that's why it's irregular. It doesn't follow the rules. I should have to put an S on it. But that's not right. Foot does not turn into foots. It turns into feet. So these are the kind of words we're going to be looking at today. The ones that change or don't follow the rules. So when you have two feet, it's not foots. You all knew that, I know. Here's another one. Tooth. Now, I think you guys have about 20 tooths in your head. Do you have tooths? I lost four tooths. No, you didn't lose tooths. That's not even a word. You lost what? Yeah, teeth. Tooth changes to teeth, not tooths. You all knew that one too, didn't you? Yeah, I've never heard anybody in here say, oh, I've got four tooths. You knew better. Oh, child is another one of these irregular words that don't follow the rules. I have 13 childs in my class. I have childs. I have three childs at my house. No, you don't have childs. Childs isn't a word. I have three. Yeah, children, not childs. So child changes to children. That's what makes these words irregular because they change into something else instead of following the rules. Here is another irregular noun, an irregular plural noun. I didn't see five mans. What did I see? I didn't see five mans. I saw five men. Yeah, man changes to men, not mans. That's no such thing. A woman is another one. Did I see 20 womans standing over there? Look at all those womans. No, it's not womans. It's, yeah, women. Woman changes to women. Just like man and men. They have the same word at the end of them. Oh, here's another one. Goose. I went to the park and I saw 15 gooses. No, I didn't see any gooses. I saw geese. There you go. One goose, lots of geese. You have to change goose to geese. That's what makes it irregular or not normal. It doesn't follow the rules. It changes. Oh, here's a really tricky one. And people say this one wrong all the time. When I was driving down the road today, I saw five deers. No, actually, you did not see five deers. 
because there's no such thing as deers. The word deer, look at that. It doesn't change. It doesn't matter if there is one deer or a hundred deer. You still just say deer. Isn't that weird? Yeah, that one definitely is a rule breaker. It doesn't change at all. It doesn't matter singular or plural. It's always deer. One deer, 50 deer. One deer, two deer. One deer, 10 deer. It's still always deer. Deer does not change. Here is another word that does not change. Sheep. One sheep, five sheep. One sheep, 20 sheep. One sheep, 100 sheep. It's always just sheep. There's no such thing as sheeps. You didn't see any sheeps in the field. You just saw sheep. Isn't that weird? They really don't follow the rules. All right, here's another irregular noun. Shelf. Like, I have three bookshelves in my room. I have bookshelves. I don't think I have a bookshelves. I have book shelves. You see how the S changes to a V and they put ES. So, words that have an F a lot of times are going to turn to Vs and put ES. So, shelf turns to shelves. And I'm sure you knew that. I'm going to go hang some shelves up. You wouldn't say I'm going to go hang some shelves up. You've heard people say that they're shelves. Um, ooh, I thought of something. If I go in here, look at this. I thought of another one. Since it's getting close, look at that one. If I take off the ESs, I'm sorry, the SHs. Elf changes to elves. Santa has a hundred elves. He doesn't have a hundred elves. There's no such word as elf. Elves. It's elves. So I thought of that one too. Oh, here's one leaf. We raked up the leaves and we jumped in them. We raked up the leaves. That doesn't sound right. We didn't rake up the leaves. We raked up the leaves. Yeah, since it has that F, we change it to a V and we put ES. So leaf changes to leaves. You knew that one. I know you did. All right, there's another irregular plural noun, hoof. A horse doesn't just have one hoof. It has four hoofs. No, it doesn't have hoofs. A horse has four hooves. And good, the hooves are the horse's feet. So they have four hooves, not four hoofs. There's no, no such thing as a hoofs. It's just one hoof, four hooves. You have to change it to this word. So do you guys think you know about some irregular plural nouns now? We'll go back over and you can look at them again. Remember, they're irregular because they don't follow the rules. You have to change them somehow. Unless you're with words like child and, I'm sorry, not child. Words like deer and sheep that don't change at all. So, all right. I think you all are ready to practice with some irregular plural nouns. I'm just going to give you a real quick little work and you're going to show me that you remember what these words would change into since they're irregular. All right, good luck guys.